Hello and welcome to a video showing you how to use the ballpark images that you can download from sportsreplays.net. Here I am on sportsreplays.net's website and as you can see if I scroll down to the bottom of the download page some customers have shared some images that they have created for the game and you can download any one of these zip files depending on the resolution you want and you can include these into the game. And the 2011 park images will fit fine for the 2012 season except for Miami. There is no Im image for the new Miami ballpark. After you download the zip file, the first step is to make sure you extract the contents of the zip file into your ballparks folder, which is located in the directory you installed Digital Diamond Baseball. This will put a bunch of images and property files into your ballpark folder so you can select them for the images for each ballpark. Once you've extracted the contents of the ballpark uh, zip file that you downloaded from Sports Replays, you want to go to the Teams menu item and choose Ballparks. I'm doing this in the library for the 2012 All-Star Break season that's located on Sports Replays. That library contains ballparks for every park uh, for the 2012 season. The problem is that for each of these ballparks, the images are pointing to the default image. If you want to change these images to the ones you just downloaded, select a ballpark, click on the dot 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 button next to the daytime park image, and pick the appropriate ballpark. In this case, I'm going to go to 2011 uh, Los Angeles Angels for Angels Ballpark. Then I need to pick the appropriate property file for the daytime park. And I'm going to again choose the 2011 Los Angeles Angels properties file. Then I need the appropriate night park image, which in this case there's only one image for each stadium. So you have to pick the same one for day and night. Then I'm going to pick the appropriate properties file again right here. And you have to do this for every park listed in your library. Once you do it for every park, you will have a ballpark image set up for each stadium. Okay, we'll quickly test this. Instead of doing it for every park, I'm going to quickly just start a game for Los Angeles Angels. Make them the home team so we can be sure to see their park. And sure enough, the ballpark is displayed for the Angels. I hope this is helpful. Uh, if you have any questions, let me know. Enjoy the game.